Felipe here from cajonmaster.com and I hope everybody's doing well. If you like reviews like this one, make sure to hit the like button and subscribe to the channel. Today I'm reviewing a cajon that everybody asks about. The Mino Jumbo Subwoofer Cajon. The subwoofer model is a well-known minor percussion cajon and it's well known to have a deep bass sound because of its size and construction. So let's check the minor percussion website and see the specifications. This cajon comes with three internal fixed set of snare wires, like those ones that you find in a snare drum. They say, the snares react perfectly to soft finger rolls, ghost notes, and loud backbeat slap tones when played near to the top corners. Let's see. Bass reflex system. According to the website, positioning sound ports on the front envelops you in a healthy dose of low-end tone while projecting your beats directly towards your audience. This system directs sound waves and air through the sound ports in the front. This gives the ultra low bass sound. The body of this cajon is made of an eco-friendly medium density fiber board, or MDF. And the front plate, or tapa, is made of walnut wood. Walnut is used in drum set manufacturing for its even levels of heights, mids, and lows. It also creates a wide open sound that is loaded with warmth and depth perfect for a jumbo-sized bass cajon like this one. In the back, you can see a hole that works as a handle to carry the cajon. The size of this cajon is 19 inches by 13.5 by 13 inches. This cajon costs $199 in the US and 195 euros in Europe. If after watching this video, you like this cajon and want to buy it, you can use the link I have put in the description below. So, let's see how it sounds. I'm recording the audio of this cajon with two microphones, the ones I normally use here. The AKG C3000 in the top front, and the Shure Beta 52 in the sound port, in the low part of the front. Now I'm going to jam a little bit and use different dynamics for you to listen how it sounds.
starting with the bass sound. I have to say, it's really deep and also dry. I think this system with the two sound ports in the front work just fine. The snare sound is more similar to a deep and fat snare drum. I missed a little bit of the smack sound I normally have with other types of cajons, but still very nice. As a snare cajon, I like the sensitivity for ghost notes or finger rolls. Normally the snare cajons are less sensitive than flamenco cajons for example, but this one, it's great. The design is cool and the tapa made of walnut wood looks very nice. Overall, I would say that it's a great cajon for drummers. It's built with this intention, I think, because of the deep bass tone and the fat snare sound. If you are looking to buy a snare cajon with that deep bass sound, I think in this price range of $200, that's the best you can get. I'm happy to have done this review and sound test after many requests about the subwoofer cajon. I hope you like it and it was helpful for you. If you like this cajon and want to buy it, you can use the link I've put in the description below. Please leave your comment below with your opinions about this cajon and all the cajons. If you watch this and other videos on the channel and want to learn how to play the cajon, I'm offering a free starter crash course, link in the description below. I would like to thank all the support here and also on Instagram and Facebook. Thanks a lot. Make sure to like the video, subscribe to the channel and hit the bell for notifications. Thank you so much for watching. I will see you very soon in the next video. Bye.